Alright, there we go. Hello everybody, my name is HolyFlare484 and welcome back to Legacy of Cain, Soul Reaper. Now, of course, you're immediately seeing that, hey, this looks a lot different. Well, I found out that there's a PC port of this game and it looks and runs a lot smoother than the PlayStation 1 version I was using. Yeah, I switched from RetroArch was the emulator I was using to play Soul Reaver and I switched over to the PC port. I got back to where I was and now it's on. Now there are a few things I want to immediately do first. I found out where the sanctuary the plan was. I jumped around. Gonna have to come back there later. Oh, gem. These artifacts enhance your stamina, enabling you to prolong your material manifestation. Gather five to complete the emblem and thereby augment your strength. Ah, so that's what that means.
to come back here. Actually, go back into the spectrum. Such objects are but shadows in the spirit world.
about the thing.
Raziel. Cain! The Abyss has been unkind. I am your creation, Cain. Now, as before, you criticize your own work. What have you done with my clan, degenerate? You have no right. What I have made, I can also destroy, child. Damn you, Cain! You are not God! This act of genocide is unconscionable! Conscience? You dare to speak to me of conscience? Only when you have felt the full gravity of choice should you dare question my judgment. Your life span is a flicker compared to the mass of doubt and regret that I have borne since Mortanius first turned me from the light. To know that the fate of the world hangs dependent on the advisedness of my every deed? Can you even begin to conceive what action you would take in my position? I would choose integrity, Cain. <laughs> Look around you, Raziel. See what has become of our empire. Witness the end of an age. The clans scattered to the corners of Norsgoth. This place has outlasted its usefulness. As have you. The Soul Reaver, Cain's ancient blade, older than any of us and a thousand times more deadly. The legends claimed that the blade was possessed and thrived by devouring the souls of its victims. For all our bravado, we knew what it meant when Cain drew the Soul Reaver in anger. It meant you were dead. Oh, 
moment and ever afterwards, you and this blade are inextricably bound. Soul Reaver and Weaver of Souls, your destinies are intertwined. By destroying the sword, you have liberated it from its corporeal prison and restored it to its true form. A rage blade, its energy unbound. No longer a physical blade, it can only manifest itself in the material realm when your strength is fully restored. Once manifest, it will sustain you. What are you, little soul? Another of Cain's creatures come to taunt this bound spectre. I did not intend to disturb your rest. Rest. A body is needed for sleep. Flesh and bones are required to recline. No, child. All I may do is watch and remember, ceaselessly conscious as this wretched world's history unfurls. Ghastly past, insufferable future, are they one and the same? Am I always here? How have you come to haunt these pillars? Cain refused the sacrifice. The pillar of balance, corrupted to its core, stands as a monument to his blind ambition. Now these pillars serve only to bind me here, my prison and eternal home, thanks to the avarice of your master, Cain. That bastard can claim no allegiance from me. Then we share a common foe, Raziel. Return here when you have need. Ariel remembers what others have forgotten. Far in the eastern mountains, a stifled titan stands in mute surrender, unwilling host to a parasitic swarm.
Brother Zephon's keep lies far to the east, beyond the ruins that greeted your first exit from the underworld. He and his brood have cocooned themselves in a derelict cathedral, having murdered its human guardians.
because I don't think that they survived. Because that's their entire body just getting destroyed. Once a testament to mankind's defiance of Cain's empire, this towering cathedral now stood derelict. The humans who worshipped here, dead for centuries. Its architects conceived this tower as a holy weapon against the vampire menace, a colossal instrument of brass and stone. The cathedral's pipes, once tuned to blast a deadly hymn, now stood silent, and these vacant spaces whistled their impotence.
seeing what's down here. Probably gonna end. Oh, probably gonna end the video here. Yeah. So I uh, thank you guys for watching. I'll try and find out what I need to do tomorrow. Well, not tomorrow. Next time I upload. So uh, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed. Like, subscribe, do whatever. I can't stop you or control you. And I will see you guys later. Bye.